so carrying on from our next lesson, what we're going to do in this one is we're going to create a sprite now. A sprite is a moving character within your game or you can get it to interact with other things. Now to add a sprite in first we need to have a variable for it. So if we go to add new action or event and add the variable in and I did say it was called a sprite so let's go down And if you click on Sprite, there we have, we've got a simple Sprite here. Now, I don't want to upload um, a picture, I want to use one that already exists. So I'm going to add another one in. Uh, so I'm going to add a picture again. Picture. And I'm going to go and search online for a picture. And I'm going to search for a football. Alright, so I've got a Nike football here. I've got lots of different footballs okay uh, so I'll just use this one right so I've got this Nike football here so if I go back to my main code I've got a sprite which I should have given a name my football alright so I've got my sprite and what I need to do is click into my code don't make the mistake of adding in after this because remember we need to post to the wall so if you add before it what we need to do is do data all right, and we're going to pick your sprite so my football and you want to assign it to the board so that the board creates the picture so you should see here create picture and if you click on this you can pick your artwork again. Art, and there's the night football. Okay, so I'm going to add the next line in now. So we've created that picture. Now the next thing we need to do is actually set the height and the width. So watch, you can do data, my football. Now you can either use variables like we did earlier, or you can just use set width. So I'm going to set it to 75. I'm going to do data again, my football. Uh, so I've got set width. I need to set height now. So let's set height. I'm going to set that at 75. So we've got the size. And the last thing we need to do is actually set the position of it. So if I go to data, my football, set position, I can set where I want it, so I'm going to say 200 by 200. So I'll, I'll let me just go through this. So I've got the football and I've assigned it to the board and created the picture of it. I then set the width and set the height just by pressing simple buttons. And I've also set the position of it to 200 by 200. Remember at the end of your app you need to post it to the wall. So if I come out of this now and run this you should see a football downloading art and there's the football there so you could create multiple sprites and use the picture over and over so I could have uh, my football too and have m more than one football so that they interact with each other and you can also play around with the variables so I could have it 150 by 150 and I could maybe move it further down the screen Alright, so you've got the X coordinate, which is this one, which is left and right, and you've got the Y coordinate, which is up and down. Alright, if you want to explain that. And it also helps here to explain it to your students. So let's just come off this, and we're going to press run, and you can see the football is much bigger and it's moved down the screen now. So have a play around with that, see if you can add a sprite for your game, and this is what it should look like when it's finished. Thank you for watching.